little different walking into the voting booth and not seeing my name on the ballot. After 20 years serving as Commissioner of Labor and eight years in the General Assembly, Cherie Berry is retiring. Oh my God, you're the elevator lady. That's right, Cherie Berry, the elevator lady, as everyone has come to know and love in North Carolina, is letting someone else take this next ride. Cherry Berry, Cherry Berry. Her picture is plastered in every elevator across the Tar Heel State. It started in her first term when her communications manager wanted to put a face to the inspection certificate hanging in each elevator. Sharice said no at first. Let's wait to see if I get reelected. And history was made. I guess so. <laughs> <laughs> Let the legend build. <laughs> the legend of Cherry Berry has elevated a cult status. Oh my gosh. Well, I can't go into a big box store like a Lowe's or a Home Depot, you know, on a weekend mm -hmm. when I'm filthy, dirty, and sweaty and just want to grab a bag of topsoil or something and run back out. Her fame reaches far across the globe from a parody Twitter account to her face printed on t-shirts. <laughs> Beers are named after her. <laughs> and songs are written about Cherry Berry, the elevator lady. Uh, okay. Like you had a lot of fun at your job. I had a lot of fun with that, but I think that probably because they could make my name rhyme mm -hmm. instead of Cherie Berry. Everybody called me Cherry Berry, you know, like I'm a Baskin Robbins flavor of the month or something. <laughs> you might think there's been a lot of ups and downs with being the elevator lady. Did anyone ever recognize you in an elevator? Oh, yes, absolutely. One day, I remember I was in a hotel, I think it was in Greensboro, and I was at the back of the elevator, and some guy was at the front by the certificate, and he was pointing at it, and he said, I bet that's a joke name. Who has that name? Cherry Berry. <laughs> and uh, I reached up, tapped him on the shoulder. I said, excuse me, sir, but I do. <laughs> Any regrets you have from the job? Not a single one. It's been the best job I've ever had. <laughs> Cherie says she'll miss the people she's worked with, but what she's missed most by working so much are hanging out with her grandkids and great-grandchildren. I will no longer be commissioner of labor. I'll be mammal. And with no campaign to run in decades. What are you going to be doing election night? I'm going to be at home in Catawba County on my couch with an adult beverage in my hand, probably a martini. I'm gonna have my five kitty cats all around me and I'm gonna have my rubber band gun and I'll be shooting the television as the results come through and my cats will be having a ball jumping up and trying to catch those rubber bands. <laughs> If I don't like the results, if I like the results, I'm going to just calm down and enjoy it. But if I don't, I'm going to be shooting the television with my rubber band gun. We should have a camera at your place doing that. <laughs> <laughs> if you're not allergic to cats, come on up. <laughs>